I don't think he's getting up from that one. Ethan told me what happened. Said I might find you here. Said you might be about to do something stupid. If you're here to change my mind, just don't. No. No, I'm not. When are we gonna head down to the station? Soon, I guess. Before you go. What did I just say, Frank? I know. But you can't expect me to stand by and do nothing. Yes. Actually, that is exactly what I expect from you. Tommy, I am not gonna let you willingly throw your fucking life away. What life? Hmm? What life am I throwing away exactly, Dad? I lay fucking bricks for a living. The world isn't gonna have a giant Thomas-shaped hole in it when I'm gone. But Ethan? He's got two girls at home and they need him. What do I have? Who do I have? Look, you've never been good at this parenting shit. I don't expect you to start now. You know, I never got the chance to say goodbye to her. What? Your mother. The hardest part was accepting that I couldn't save her. So I took the easy way out, you know? I thought the drink it help. Take the pain away. I fucked up. I know. I, I, I wasn't there for you. It's not fair on you or Ethan. I'm not, not making any excuses, I'm just... I'm just trying, Tommy. You're trying? Where were you when it mattered? I needed this when I was a kid, I don't need you now. Look, if I could t take it all back, change it all, I would, but I can't. I, I gotta live with the choices that I made. I got a lifetime of making up to do, Tommy. I just... I don't want you walking down the same road I took. What do you want me to do? Sit by, do nothing, let him go to jail? I don't know, yeah, maybe. But I know we can, we can work it out. As a family. Family. Come on, Tommy. This isn't just another minor offence that you can take on the chin and brush off like it's nothing. Manslaughter's a knockout. You do this, you're never getting back up, mate. Yeah, well, maybe I don't want to get back up. I'm tired, Frank. I'm tired of getting knocked down. I've only ever had one person in my corner. And I'm not gonna sit by, do nothing, let his kids grow up without their dad. Not when I have the chance to prevent that. I know firsthand what that can do to a kid. And for that to happen, Katie and Sarah, of all the people. It's just cruel. When she died, the day you decided to stop being a parent, he was all I had. He's all I've had since.